I think we should have and could have won and gone on with it in the second half and it was very disappointing. I think we lost our mojo, connections, there's a whole heap to work on. It's really important to make sure that we give our youngsters an opportunity as long as they've earned it um, and to make sure that you know we get the win. I mean at the end of the day we're absolutely devastated we've lost this game. It, we don't purposely go out to lose a test match when you're playing for your country. Um, you know, so we're really annoyed. Um, but we just have to pick ourselves up and show our Australian fans, and we've got so many of them, that a lot of them were here today, and that's why the girls are spending more time out there. We just have to bring our A game to Perth, not you know a C game um, that just wasn't good enough today. But also the Silver Ferns were terrific today. You know, there's no excuses. At the end of the day, we should have won today. That that was an opportunity that went begging. We review the way that we've always done, whether it's a win or a loss, and, and then prepare for Friday. We had, um, you know, th we knew we were playing three tests in a short amount of time, and we got given a break after World Cup. And you know, Lisa, along with the medical staff, have done a great job in managing the players' loads. So. We don't use that as an excuse. We do everything absolutely possible to recover. Um, but yeah, I, I know I'm certainly looking forward to Friday's game, but yeah, the way that second half went, um, it's a credit to New, to New mm, Zealand absolutely. Silver Ferns and it's not, I don't think it had anything to do with fatigue.